Hello everyone. I wanted to introduce you to one of our newest listings. It is in Southgate at Eagles Landing, right off of exit 224, 399 Langshire Drive in McDonough. This is a nice house, y'all. Come on. I love the double storm doors. Thank you, ma'am. Okay. All right, so we're going to walk in, and I'm going to ask you, young lady, if you've done this way, if you would go ahead of me and start turning the lights on, okay? There we go. Okay, so I'm going to follow you. We'll start in here. Formal dining room. How many is there? Six, eight. I love the ceilings. I love the huge windows. Notice all of the trim and all of the molding. Hardwood floors, lots of molding here. Like, this is a lot of detail, y'all. You don't typically see this. I and mean, if you look up here in the corners, that is an extensive molding package when you build a house. We got tile here and a formal living room here, like the light fixtures. Hardwood floors again. Lots of molding again. Even this right here is considered an upgrade because it's taller than regular baseboards. They have the extended taller baseboards. We come around this corner and there's a full bathroom here. Look at the tile. And then a bathroom here, I'm sorry, a bedroom here. Let's look at the closet size. Lots of good storage. And then this door here leads to this bathroom we just showed you. Okay, we can keep coming this way. Um, just wait, give me, give me this. So we have formal, not formal, great room. I like all the appliances. I said appliances, that's an appliance, but it's a, it's a fixture. I said appliances. I'm acting like it's Friday. Um, okay. Look at that pretty dog out there. We'll go see you later, baby. Okay. I like the tile. Look at the details of the fireplace. This is all tile down here. Look at the molding here. Very, very nice. Even the cutout here is very nice. Hardwood again. Okay. Now we have our breakfast area. I love all of these upgraded fixtures. Tons of counter space. Look at all this counter. That's what I'm talking about. So I could do so much cooking. <laughs> yeah, right. I can't remember the last time I've been in the grocery store. I'm so serious. I think it's been over a month. Um, lots of counter space. You also have the stone backsplash all the way around. I like having two windows in the kitchen. Microwave, oven, and then let's look at the pantry. That's a big pantry. Can you see? Okay. Okay, dope ladies. You got that nice fridge. I like this area over here as well. I love the archways. Again, we've got a lot of extensive molding. You come down here, remember that was the um, dining room. There is a half bath down this hall. Laundry room with tile floor as well. Okie doke. I said okie doke. Okay. Oh, no. Nope. Well, I'm going to have you go behind me and turn everything off. All right. Good size garage. Okay, Would that so, be a two car or a three car? That's a two car. So um, let's hit the, let's, we'll do the basement lap. Well, we're already here. Let's go downstairs and look at the basement. Hold on now. Oh, mama got to hold on. So what I really like about this house too, there is great padding, great padding in this carpet. Can you feel it? Mm-hmm. So this is where the components, some of the components of the house. It's got two hot water tanks, an expansion tank on it. 
So this is what I call a real basement apartment. Not just like an in-law suite or some extra room. Because if you look, come this way. Why don't you come this way? If you look, if you go turn those lights on for me, and we're going to make our way through there. So when you come downstairs, you have this area, a family room with a real kitchen. There is a real bedroom over here. I love her bedroom. Look at all the sunlight. So what take what constitutes a bedroom? You have to have a door, a closet, and a window. Full-size bath here with a jacuzzi tub. And it's got the tile surround, the 12 inch ceramic tiles. This carpet, I think is, I think this carpet is almost new. Okay, and we walk over here and look down here. There is a formal dining room. I've been selling houses a lot of times, a long time. I don't normally see a formal dining room down in the basement, but it is. Look how they did the trim all around they did just a greater job down here as they did upstairs here just storage can you see you pick around the corner all right well let's go be careful let's go to the kitchen kitchen has a gigantic pantry itself again we got solid surfaces so this is what we call Corian. Corian is not as expensive as granite or marble, but it is solid, so you don't have to worry about replacing it. It's a type of stone. Also has the stone backsplash. Stainless steel appliances. Tons of, like, this is a nice kitchen in a basement. I've seen, uh, this is better than some uh, expensive homes I've seen. And here's another bedroom back here with another bathroom. This is a two bedroom, two bathroom basement apartment. Pretty nice. Mm -hmm. Four ninety. Four ninety. Anyone buy it? <laughs> <So>, uh, <laughs> um, we have another gigantic closet back here, and then storage right here as well in this closet. Okay. Okay. Alright, let's go this way. And Elena's going to turn off all the lights. We went from there. So do you notice that there's a window there? Mm-hmm. But look what what's outside the window. Go walk up to it. Y'all just thought it was outside, huh? They fooled us. There's plants back there. A, a fake skyline. What is that? Mm -hmm. yeah. So they built it to make it look like because you can't get any sunlight through that way. All right, we can go out here. Now, if we go out here, I think the dog's going to run downstairs. No, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. He could. He just don't know we down here yet. I start running. You better back up. <laughs> Can you see the backyard? They're getting it sodded. Hey, boy. <laughs> Kendra going to come down the stairs. Hi, sweet. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, baby girl. Come on, just like Come see me. Got the little screened-in area. You heard me say this is getting sodded. The backyard, they're doing some work on it. And you can go under there. Running down upstairs. Well, I mean, the place today. Now she's a friendly dog. Yeah. Oh, she's staying off. Look, you never know. Oh, I'm holding the door for you. Okay, come on. <laughs> All right. Now we're going to make our way. Lock that, please. So even when I'm in a house and if the door is unlocked, I'm locking it anyway. No one's ever going to be able to say that I didn't lock the door. Okay. All right. And we're going back. Don't fall. <laughs> These uh, 
heels are uh, extra high. They're higher than what I normally wear. They're about a half an inch higher, so I have to make a conscious effort not to drag my heel. All righty, let's make our way upstairs, lovely ladies. Shut that light off. I'll wait for you. Like the hardwood floors, the steps. <sighs> I'm tired, y'all. That's two flights of stairs right there. You think I'm joking? Okay. A loft area that is like a second great room, a second family room. It still has trim up here. Let's come down this way. Because I want to save the master for last. Still trying to catch my breath. Okay, another bedroom. And a bathroom. This is a Jack and Jill bathroom. That means you can walk through and end up in another bedroom. Jack and Jill. So notice, even upstairs, they have really good trim work. You don't normally see columns upstairs. Another bedroom here with its own bathroom. All the bathrooms have tile on the floors and the count the counters. Okay, dope. Big this size closet. This size closet. Yeah, let's go. Hardwood floors up here too. And this is the master. Isn't this huge? It is. This is my huge columns. Now, usually in homes, you see a column, but the columns are usually about this big. This is about four times the size of a regular column. And you got trim work up here. See it? A double tray ceiling. I love smooth ceilings. I don't like the ceilings that look like a chicken ran through wet paint. The popcorn. Mm -mm, popcorn looks like popcorn crumbs. The chicken running through wet paint. I got chicken ceiling then. <laughs> I always thought it was called popcorn. Uh-uh. It's the one where it almost looks like you literally put a foot in and you lift it up and it's got the little... Mm -hmm, and it pokes. Mm -hmm. That's what I got. <laughs> Unfortunately. Look at this master bathroom. I love the sinks. Granite countertops. This is Eagle's Landing where we have some... Athletic stars, a couple of rappers, a couple of famous comedians and folks in here. Look how big that shower is. Can you see? If I had a shower this big when y'all was little, all y'all would have been bathing together. I believe it. <laughs> all would have been like, Treasure, go get your sisters and y'all go take a shower. <laughs> I would have. Okay. Big, huge walk-in closet. And jacuzzi tub with a step. That is a jacuzzi tub for two. One on one side, one on the other side. And then the water closet. Call the water closet. Let's go. I think we're about done, aren't we? I think we have seen everything. Don't we have to see the top of the deck? Yeah, out the kitchen. Ooh, dang it, hold on. I hold it on. I hold it on, Treasure. I know, you're going slow. <laughs> Let's go this way. We'll go out the deck. Oh. oh she said come get her, but. there you can see it from here i kind of wanted to get an overview okay 
You ain't afraid of that dog? No. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hi, oh, baby. <laughs> no. I need you to get. No. No. Sit. 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 Good dog. <laughs> I love my job. Okay, you signing off? What a good dog. That's a good girl. Yeah, you just want some love. I don't even know your name. Can you say goodbye to the people? Okay, bye, people. <laughs>